So these are cherry chips. They are one of the common uh, mulch-loving fungi. They uh, are much more common than they used to be. They're actually a native Australian fungus that has found its patch in mulch and is very happy. So um, I've been walking this creek for the last uh, four years and I hadn't seen it until last year when we got this uh, mulch laid next to the creek. And this year we get cherry chips. So it's a good recognizable fungi if you don't want to disturb fungi and you want to look underneath one of the important characters is actually the spore color and we work that out by looking at the gills of the older ones and you can see these are darkening particularly in these really old ones like this um, and that means it's got dark colored spores because the gills go from a pale color to a dark color and that really helps us with identification so some of the characters to look out for for cherry chips is in the little young ones we've got these um, cute little fragments sometimes they're a little bit sticky on top uh, and these are mushroom shaped or some people call them agarics I often use a little stick to lift them up and so you can see this one's got much paler gills and it's got the little beautiful orange color there it's holding on to the mulch and you can see there that is a bundle of hyphae or mycelium holding this mulch together which is why fungi are actually great for holding um, soil and mulch and wood so they actually help prevent erosion they're not perfect like anything in nature but they're part of the cleanup job they're recycling this nutrients they're holding it all together and stopping it washed down into the creek so they're really important jobs so yeah, cherry chips. I've got uh, the booklet um, that you can get from the Mary Creek website. Uh, I printed it out. I've only printed it out in black and white because I tend to know the fungi. But if you just want to get started somewhere, this booklet will hopefully help you um, by seeing some of the fungi that you will see on the Mary Creek. And yeah, cherry chips or the Radiomyces series, if you really want to get serious and start learning the Latin names, um, is just here. So the first few fungi, and imagine this in colour, are mushroom shaped fungi, so fungi like these. We then have a group of the mushroom shaped fungi called the ink caps, uh, and they're very common and very common on mulch, which is common in the urban environment. And then we have a few more weird and wonderful shaped fungi which aren't mushrooms. So that page and whoop, the next page. And finally, we have fungi that are likely to be rare and threatened. So you mightn't see them, but if you do see them, you can actually gather some really important data to help try and save these fungi which have disappeared from the Greater Melbourne area and along the Mary Creek.